Welcome back to Ozarks Live. We're lucky enough to have another artist from the Fresh Gallery in Springfield with us today. Say hello to artist and member of Fresh Gallery, Nadine Elman. Nadine, yes. tell me about your love for watercolor. Well, I love art, but watercolor is my passion. And how long have you been doing that? About 15 years. Kind of a late bloomer. I raised my family early on, and now that we're finished with that part of our life, this is what I do. Yeah, but this has become a big passion for you. Yes. And yes. I noticed I, on the website, it you, I guess, on the website, we're talking about how you can get these different effects. Like when you layer watercolor, I don't know a lot about that. Can you explain what that means? Sure. Uh, watercolor paintings are, are layered one color on top of the other. Okay. Start with a real light layer and you get your depth and your deep colors by keep layering on. Oh. Yeah. And it, the trick is though, you don't want to, you want to make sure that your painting dries before you add your other layer, otherwise it turns to mud. <laughs> I think that's probably been my, my experience <laughs> the only time I've done watercolor, probably 15 years ago. Um, is it hard to do, like I'm noticing a face over here. Mm -hmm. is, faces are hard anyway, but with watercolor, it seems like it'd be really challenging. Um, it, <clears throat> I think, for me, uh, that is what I do best, are faces. Really? Okay. Yes, that's what, that's what I enjoy mostly. Uh -huh. I do a lot of commissions. This one is of my husband, uh -huh. by the way, so I know him well. I know his face so very well. So I was well. commissioned for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. And I do uh, young children. I've done uh -huh. a lot of grandchildren for clients. Uh -huh. um, so that is what, that, that's what I love to do the most. Yeah. Why don't you tell me about the pieces that you brought? Well, this one, of course, like I said, is my husband. and. This I uh, titled Remembering 2020. So it's mm. very pensive, uh, lots going on in his, you know, in his mind and lot has happened since. But Did you base that on a photograph? Or? Yes, okay. yes, I usually do my paintings from photographs. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, thank you, yeah. thank you. And then what's this one? This one is uh, two of my grandchildren. In fact, they were over this weekend and the little one on top, Jane, said make sure I mention her name. <laughs> uh -huh. Adorable. So, yeah, thank you. Thank yeah. you. And that is also from a photograph. Uh-huh. And then what do we have here? And that is a floral. I normally don't do florals, but mm -hmm. I'm starting to enjoy to do them more. Um, this one I'm going to be auctioning off at the Lifehouse, uh, and that'll be on September 7th, or September 16th. Now you said that was a, is that a national show? Oh, no, no. This is, this is, um, this is something that we do every year, and I always donate a, a painting. Okay. And they auction it off. It's a fundraiser. It's fundraiser. a big fundraiser for their the for the year, the okay. Lifehouse uh -huh. Catholic Charities. Oh, I understand. And this one is called um, Botan Botanicals of Christ, and in each of those uh, flowers, I I kind of researched frankincense, myrrh, and all the things that Christ might have mm. experienced while he was here on earth. Uh -huh. I like the, um, it's, it's kind of a passion you put behind yes. what you're actually painting. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's beautiful. And then the last one down there are my dogs, my two poodles. Mm. Um, and I love doing pet portraits too. Okay. So we can commission you out for that as well. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So where can we find your work? Um, I'm, I'm right now at, at uh, Fresh Gallery and that's uh, 401 Boonville. Okay just uh, north of the square. Okay. And uh, do you have a website? No, I just put my things on Facebook and okay. that seems to work for me. Yeah, these are absolutely amazing. Thank you so Thank much you. for coming in and sharing this with us. And yeah, my I, pleasure. Thank I you. I love learning about new art styles that I'm not used to. <laughs> so, all right, coming up, Blake and I are going